Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And if you're planning to sell your DJI drone, which includes the DJI Mini 3 Pro, and you also have the DJI RC controller, which you're planning to sell with your drone, then, well, you do need to perform a few steps before you sell your DJI drone and the DJI RC controller. And that is what we're going to cover in this video, how to factory reset and make sure that you do not have any of your data left on the drone or either on the DJI RC controller before you sell it and it is easy for the new owner to set it up. Now the first thing you might want to do is take out your micro SD card from the drone and you can do the same thing for the DJI RC controller as well. You have this lift up flap and in here if you have a micro SD card inserted make sure you pop those out. Now popping out the micro SD card from your drone or the DJI RC controller is as easy as pushing it in and bam here it is. You can see that the micro SD has now popped out and I can remove it. Now in case you are selling your DJI drone with the micro SD card I do suggest that you back up your photos videos whatever content you have and then the next thing we are going to do is format your micro SD cards so for that we need to turn on the drone and we also need to turn on the DJI RC controller and make sure that they are connected to each other so here it is we are on the camera preview screen and on the top right you have three dots select those options and then we can go into the camera section here and you need to scroll down and you will see the option for storage once you are in storage select format another pop-up window is going to show up you can select your internal storage or your sd card and i do recommend that you do both of them once you've made your choice select format and that is going to erase your micro sd card and your internal storage the next and the most important thing we need to do before we sell our DJI drone is to remove our account from the DJI RC controller and also unbind the device from the drone so that it is easier for the next user or the person who is buying your drone to create their own DJI account. So while you are in the camera view on the top left you will see a back arrow. We are going to select that and now we are in the DJI Fly app. We are going to tap on the profile option on the bottom. Once you do that you will see device management so that is what we are going to select. Now once you have selected device management you will land up on a screen like this here and make sure that you have your Wi-Fi enabled on the DJI RC controller. If you do not have it then swipe down once, swipe down one more time and enable your Wi-Fi. Next thing we need to do is select remove device from account then we're going to say next and on this screen you have to select confirm and say confirm one more time and there it is device unbound from your account successfully so we can close this now and then you will have to go into value added service and repeat the steps select unbind device over here select next tap on confirm and you should get an appropriate message there it is unbinding was successful next thing we need to do is we need to perform a factory reset of the dji rc controller so how do you do that well you need to swipe down once swipe down one more time and then you will get this menu or these icons tap on the setting icon on the top right here and you need to go into system and once you are in system you will go into reset options erase all data factory reset erase all data erase all data one more time and bam there it is factory reset of the dji rc controller is in progress we have also unbinded the drone from the controller Next thing, if you are in the United States, then you would have registered your DJI drone with the FAA on FAA Drone Zone. So this here is the website FAA Drone Zone hyphen access dot FAA dot G O V. So we're going to log in over here. And now once you have logged in, we're going to go into launch drone owners and pilots dashboard. Now that is going to open up another page and here and we need to go into manage device inventory. On the next screen you will notice all the drones which you have registered with FAA. So in my case it is the DJI Mini 3 Pro and all you need to do is go to the actions section. You have the three dots over here. Go into cancel and cancel the 
drone so that it is no longer registered in your name because you are going to sell this dji now once you've done all those steps you have reset your dji rc controller you have unbinded it from the dji mini 3 pro as well and if you are in the united states you have also deleted the drone from your faa on faa drone zone that should be good for you next thing just turn off the drone and once that is done you can turn off your dji rc controller as well and then you are good to ship off the drone to the new owner along with the dji rc controller